Mm-mm. Welcome back to Two New Sunrise. We are now buried in treasure. Oh, yes, we are talking about nice. turning your old antiques and collectibles into cash. And Tony Enright joins us from Treasure Hunters Roadshow. And Tony, welcome into Sunrise. Thank you for having us. Nice to have you guys back on Sunrise as well as back in the community for another exciting show. Absolutely. We're very excited. Uh, obviously, we're going to be at the Hair Arena. We've got a huge event going on uh, uh, this week. This is an opportunity for people to cash in mm-hmm. on items that they may have laying around the house. You know, we, uh, you know, people that may have a broken necklace, uh, some mm-hmm. old class rings, some pocket watches laying around the house. They may not think it's worth a whole lot, but obviously with the high prices of gold and silver, gold's over $1,000 an ounce. Silver's mm. over $17 an ounce. That stuff adds That's up nice. quickly. I feel that. So. Really I weighty. know, and as I rub this, hoping a genie <laughs> will come out. <laughs> Tell me about this. What might, if I brought this into you, Tony, mm-hmm. what might I walk away with? How much? Well, this is, uh, you know, a sterling silver, uh, you know, teapot, um, you know, probably from the early 1900s, uh, late 1800s. Um, the majority of the value is obviously going to come from the uh, sterling mm. uh, silver value. It's you know probably going to be somewhere in the hundred to hundred fifty dollar range. Okay. Tony, how much would this mug be worth at a trade show? <laughs> I'm not giving mine up. I don't know about you. But uh, and do you have to polish it and get it all ready for your viewing? Absolutely not. People don't need to organize anything or clean anything up. Just bring it in as is. We have several experts on site this week that can actually sort through their stuff, go through and figure out exactly what has value, and make an offer right on the spot. So. I mean, you collect. Well, you go to a collector's database to see if these items are needed throughout your network. That's like exactly about 5,000 people. That's right? exactly right. We have over 5,000 uh, collectors all over the world that are looking for items from the jewelry. We even have a state uh, uh, jewelers that will pay over the spot price of gold for a state and jewelry. And you're, you're paid on the spot, right? On the spot. That's correct. Wow. And it doesn't take that long to do this. So Not at all. It's about total process, probably about 15 to 20 minutes. Now, do you find that people will bring in some costume jewelry? And they think maybe it's more valuable than it really is. Sure. Um, You know, we get a lot of people that bring in costume jewelry. We do have some uh, costume jewelry dealers that we do work with. And you've got toys and trains and, uh, like, military items. Like last time you were here, you brought a sword and that type of thing. That's right. And even uh, guitars. We've got a guitar uh, sitting over there. We have guitar collectors, pocket watch collectors, currency uh, collectors. Advertising items like those old... Those old, uh, old tin and, and porcelain uh, uh, advertising memorabilia. That's really yeah. cool. Just all kinds of treasures. That's Could be in your great. attic and garage. And here's the scoop now. They're going to be at Hera October 27th through the 31st at treasurehuntersroadshow.com for more information. Of course, nowhere else but Hera. Well, of course, and uh, we'll have a web link for you as well, we hope. And uh, this ring really fits nicely, Tony. <laughs> I don't know if you admired it on my finger here, but yeah, um, yeah Dan, you know my birthday's coming yeah, up, is. and uh, I'm sure we could cut you a deal. Tony would work with you. <laughs> you have to come out and uh, try on the blue diamond that you uh, tried on the Yeah, last. don't think I haven't <laughs> forgotten about that. Oh, I have not forgotten about that. That was beautiful. Tony, thanks for coming in. Appreciate you having us on. Yeah, yeah, guys, thank you. He brought quite an entourage of treasure I don't know if they're hunters. I guess they're hunters and yeah. they're appraisers and they're everything. So Experts. Get to Hera this week if you're it's interested. It's free, by the way. Don't forget that. Time now.